Hey everyone, I just arrived at the Gold Coast and today I'm going to be showing you my vacation. I'm only going to be staying here overnight so it's quite a small trip, but Joss has decided to come along with me so I'll be showing you all the different adventures we'll be going on. So if you are new to my channel, welcome, be sure to click on the subscribe button down below and the notification bell in the corner to be notified every time I upload a new video. And be sure to visit my Instagram, it's AG Overseas Fan, and that's the exact same name as my channel name. So we have been driving for a while but I I'm pretty sure we've arrived at the resort. I have stayed here before and it's so lovely, so I'm really excited to travel back there. When we arrived at the resort, the room was all ready so we could go ahead and check in. Of course, there's the beds at the front. There's also a lovely couch and living space. And then there's a TV too, which you can move to the TV or to the lounge. And the view is so lovely from the room. It has a lovely garden tree view. So let's go ahead and unpack Joss's items. So there is a perfect cabinet space to be able to store all of her items away. So the first item we'll be placing down are our PJs, the leggings, and the matching shirt. And to complete that outfit, right next to that, we will be placing down her slippers. And then I do have a casual outfit too. And as I said before, it's only an overnight trip, so we haven't packed too much for her. So here is her beach casual outfit, which is perfect for her vacation. And then there's the matching shoes for those as well. And those are the sandals she'll be wearing down to the beach. So I didn't bring any flip-flops. She'll just go ahead and wear those. And then here we have a couple of extra jackets and a hat too. And a vacation by the beach and pool would definitely not be complete without a swimsuit. So here are some items from her collection. So there's her wetsuit top. And then we also have her matching swimsuit too. And then of course, as I said before, we won't be packing flip-flops. She'll just use the sandals from the other set too. So let's go ahead and have a look at some of the accessories that I packed for her. So first off, we have her tablet, and then up next, there is a journal, so she can write down all of her different adventures while traveling, a Luciana book, since she brought her Luciana mini doll, some sunglasses, a phone, and her hearing aid case too. And an essential that she definitely needs to bring on her trip is a toiletry case, which she could go ahead and place in the bathroom later on, but I'm just going to place it down here for now, and then also some hair accessories too. And now that we've unpacked everything, let's go ahead and see what's around the resort. So here we have Joss sitting down in front of one of the lagoons. There's a lagoon that goes all around the rooms, which is really great, and it connects everything together. And it seems like I've found the gym. I don't think I'll be heading in here over in this vacation, but it was great to take a look around. Another feature that I'm really excited to go and explore and to definitely go swimming is, of course, the pool. So here we have the gate. We're going to go ahead and open that up so we can head inside. Here's an overview of the swimming pool. It does seem to be quiet right now, but maybe everyone's at the beach. I think Joss would rather go swimming at the beach over the pool, so she might wait to go swimming until later on in the day. Joss is sitting down and relaxing on one of the beach chairs. Can you find her? She's kind of hiding and she is a little bit small, but she's definitely there. We are at the mall and we have found some doll items. There are so many different dolls, outfits, and accessories available, and it's really great to take a look at some of the sets that I haven't seen at the store before. Over in this section, there seems to be more smaller accessory packs. There is the kitchen set over there, but there's a back-to-school set and a cooking set too. But right underneath, there is a styling head, so you can practice hairstyles. A really popular furniture and accessories that would have to be the school set here, but they also have the Christmas fireplace, a horse stable, and a retro bowling alley. It's really great to see, and it seems like it's a lot of fun. I just found this lovely set that I would really like to buy. It's called Gnome Sweet Home, and it is fairy themed. And when I went to go buy it, the person was trying to fix the barcode because it wouldn't go through in the machine, and she said that it had been recalled, so I couldn't purchase it, so I wasn't sure why, so I won't be taking it home today. One store that I love visiting to take a look at some of their accessories and outfits is of course Build-A-Bear. They have their Disney princess section and some more casual outfits over on the other side. They have quite a few different bears available and there's a section where they have a blind bag so you don't know which bear you're actually opening up, which is so cool. And we're just taking a little bit of a rest. So here is an egg waffle. It's one of my favorite treats, but there are actually pearls inside. And then I also have another drink and it's passion fruit. And we are back. We're heading back to the hotel room now. It was really lovely exploring all the different stores at the mall. And since the beach is really close by to where we're staying, Joss is going to go ahead and get ready to go swimming at the beach. 
Let's go ahead and get a few items that she might need for a day by the pool. So her book, so she's able to read that and relax. Some sunglasses, but it doesn't seem to be very sunny out, so she might not need those. And then her swimsuit too. She does need a few items from this drawer as well. So first off, there's her hat, which matches her swim set, and some sandals too. It does seem to be a bit cloudy today, but since it is Queensland, it's still quite warm, so Josh should be able to still go swimming at the beach. And right in the middle of the sand, there is a surfboard, and that's for the lifeguard, and then Joss is standing right next to it. In Joss's story, she loves to go surfing, and she loves to go on the beach, so this is definitely a perfect holiday for her to go on. And over in one direction, you can see Surfer's Paradise, so that's where all the buildings are, over there. And then on the other side, it is completely clear, and there's no buildings, with a lot of trees. Joss is sitting on the sand, relaxing, and she is about to build a sandcastle. There's a bucket right next to her, and there's also some sand molds, too. It was really lovely to visit the beach, but we have to leave now. Hopefully, we'll be able to visit again. And right now we are at a jetty. There's a lot of jet skis and water sports that are done here. And it's just a lovely area with a few restaurants and cafes to visit. There is a restaurant at the hotel and they sell a lot of seafood and the prices are quite expensive. So rather than eating in the restaurant, instead we're going to be ordering room service where there's a lot more options to choose from. And since it is quite late, Joss will be getting ready for bed and she'll be getting dressed into her PJs. And since today has been such a busy day, Joss just wants to sit down and relax. She has her mini Luciana doll, so I'm going to go ahead and give her her tablet. And now it is time to order dinner. So we will be ordering off of the room service menu, which is really lovely because today has been quite tiring and exhausting. So Joss will get to choose what she wants to eat. Room service has arrived and there's actually quite a lot of food. So there's buffalo wings and onion rings. There's also a salmon dish and there's some pasta and some dessert too. And I think Joss might have ordered a little bit too much food. As I said before, it's quite late. Dinner was really lovely, but now it's time for Joss to get ready for bed. And of course, I can't forget to give her her mini Luciana doll. So good night everyone, we'll see you in the morning. Good morning everyone, it's the next day and unfortunately today we'll be checking out since it's only an overnight stay. So for today's outfit, Joss will be wearing her beach casual outfit, a part of her collection. And for breakfast today, we will be eating from the buffet and there are so many different options there. It's just a short walk away, so let's head over in that direction. We have arrived, so let's go ahead and see what they have. So over here, there are a couple of different condiments. There's yogurt and fruit too. And along this side, there's some more fresh fruit, there's whole fruit, and there's also some sliced and diced ones too. And right now, someone is making an omelette. It looks really delicious, but you can customize it and choose what you want in it. And over here, there's just a few classic breakfast food items like mushroom, tomatoes, and hash browns too. And something you wouldn't normally have for breakfast is ice cream, but they do have it here. It would be a great addition with pancakes or waffles. And if you did just want something a little bit lighter, there's cereal as well. Unfortunately, it is now time for us to leave the hotel, but I had such a lovely stay here. It was so great to explore the beach, the pool, and go shopping, and then relax at the resort as well. So thanks for watching. Hey guys, today I'm going to be packing for Joss as if she is going on a beach vacation. It is summertime here in Australia, so a lot of the items she'll be packing away is of course for summertime. So a lot of dresses and skirts, and then of course we'll be packing some swim items as well. So if you are new to my channel, welcome, be sure to click on the subscribe button down below and the notification bell in the corner so you're notified every time I upload a new video. If you'd like to see more photos and updates of Joss and her collection and some of the items that I open up on my channel, be sure to visit my Instagram. It's AG Overseas Fan, which is the exact same name as my channel name. So let's go ahead and pack her suitcase first. So let's go ahead and pack Joss's suitcase first. I have her outfits here ready to go, and it might not look like everything will fit in the suitcase, but I'll go ahead and refold everything once I place everything down so it does. So the first item we have here is her swim vest, and it's actually from her collection. And then we also have her swimsuit here too. So the bottoms are right here and then the top as well. The swim vest is a really great addition to pack in case if it is really sunny, she can wear that over the top of her swimsuit. 
The next item we'll be packing is her PJs, and these are from her collection as well. They are so bright and colorful, so there's the leggings, and then there's also the shirt as well. And this can also be used as a casual loungewear for her to wear on vacation as well. It doesn't just have to be her PJs, but those are the main ones that we will be bringing today. I would really love to pack a dress for Joss, and this can be her formal outfit, but it can also be a casual dress too, she wants it to be. It is so pretty, it has such a lovely floral design, and I especially love the pink, it matches a lot of the items we'll be packing for her today. And then of course we do need to pack a few casual outfits for her to wear as well. So here's her beach casual outfit, you've got the pants, and then you also have the tank top too, and there's a really lovely graphic design over on the front. This has to be one of my new favorite outfits from American Girl. It is from the Berry Fresh collection. I absolutely love these. They are so lovely on Joss. So we have these strawberry printed shorts and that's so perfect for a beach vacation. And then the matching shirt as well. It says Berry Fresh on it too. So I'm going to go ahead and place the shoes over at the front here. First off, there are these really lovely sandals and these are to match the dress in case if she goes out for dinner or to a fancy event, but they can also be used for a casual outfit as well. And then if she is going to the beach, she's just going to be having these casual sandals. And she can also wear these out too. And she's wearing sneakers right now, so she does have a pair of sneakers. We won't be packing any away for her. And then the last item is, of course, her slippers too. And these are so much fun. I especially love the pink pom-poms on the side. Now it is time to go ahead and pack her backpack with some of her essentials inside. So over in the front pocket, we will be adding some sunscreen, which is very important, especially since she is going to the beach. And then we also have some wet ones too. We can place right at the front. And we'll go ahead and close that. And then let's go ahead and pack the back pocket. So first off, we have her travel bag. So it has all of her essentials inside, like a comb. There's also shampoo, conditioner, just her basic essentials. And then also she'll be bringing two reading books since she's planning on reading quite a bit on this vacation. First off, there's The Secret Garden which seems like a great read. And then also a book about Luciana's story since that's the mini doll she'll be bringing. She's sitting right next to Luciana right now. So they're two very different books so she can decide which one she wants to read when she gets there. Of course, she'll be bringing her travel journal. I love the pink and purple color scheme to it. And that will be great for her to write down all of her different adventures while she's traveling. Another item she will be packing is her tablet so she can go on the internet and maybe watch YouTube if she wants to while on vacation. And then a small little treat. It is a box of cupcakes which look amazing. There's icing on the top and everything like that. Her GoPro, in case if she does end up going surfing, I'm not sure if she will, but she could film while she's surfing. Some sunglasses, that's definitely very important to bring. And her backpack is all packed now. And of course, just for some of her smaller items she needs on her straight away, we will be bringing her purse as well. So the first item is her phone, and that's of course to keep in contact with her friends and family back at home. And then also her hearing aid case too, and that has her spare hearing aid inside. Go ahead and place that inside as well. Should be able to fit, but I'm going to go ahead and place it there just for now. And then also her travel documents and her travel essential items are in that folder. Just a few extra items I didn't pack, but she will be bringing on vacation. There's her mini doll. As I said before, her choice of doll is Luciana. That's definitely a wonderful choice for her to bring on vacation. We also have a denim jacket just in case it does get a little bit colder. She can wear it over the top of any of her outfits that she's bringing, including her dress too, which is great. Also, we have a hat that matches her PJs. I love how it has the same pattern as the PJs. And then the last item is a neck pillow, so she's comfortable while traveling, and I especially love how it's themed to a unicorn. Joss is now all packed and ready to go on vacation. She has all of her essentials with her. She has her purse, her backpack, and her suitcase too. And of course, we can't forget about her mini doll as well. So thanks for watching.